Hello and welcome everybody to another unboxing video for Warhammer Stormbringer. Unfortunately, the first video I tried recording did not really take on. So let's get this started and let's try again. Hopefully my computer cooperates this time. First on, a new ring binder with issue number 23. And beware, this one costs you $9.99. It's not listed as an extra cost on your dispatch notice or invoice, but uh, as you can see from the invoice, it is 10 pounds higher than usual. So uh, that would be a nice thing if there was an advance notice on the dispatch note, just as a reminder for people that this is coming. So the other thing, and you can see everything is already opened, that this is the second attempt at this video, the alternative pose for the Gut Ripper boss and the base. The first magazine is number 23 with the Lord Aquilor and the usual readings lore, building the Lord Aquilor and painting it up to this stage. and some gaming to round it up. The next one is number 24 with the Loon Boss. And you're going to paint the Loon Boss until this stage. Uh, let's get the Loon Boss out of here or start with the Lord Aquilor because I for almost forgot that one. The Lord Aquilor and his base, the loon boss with the base, and for issue number 25 we get some more terrain and I was really looking forward to this fountain here, some really nice and heavy piece of plastic. So you definitely get your money's worth this time. They also finish painting the terrain up to a very high level in my opinion. And the last issue, number 26, is coming with two paints, contrast paint Griffhound Orange and base paint corn red with a fold out for the armies of chaos really nice illustrations here wow that is really really impressive and of course the magazine where we gonna paint some more items along the way in this case the corn red for the stormcast eternals as well as the cruel boys now, what is in episode uh, issue number 27 and 28? There will be Griffhounds and Zarbag's Gits for both sides, for both armies of this issue. Still worth the money, yes. And this time it did come exactly on time. So there is hoping that this continues and I don't have trouble with Hachette or the Stormbringer magazine again. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in a month at the very latest.